An attack on the Syrian town of Hula killed at least 90 people Saturday, including around 25 children. According to Al Jazeera, the UN-sanctioned peace plan is being ignored daily. A series of peace plans hasn't tempered the spiraling violence. To the contrary, some activists say the latest Annan peace plan has provided a cover for the army to carry on attacking them. UN officials say the forces behind the attack in Hula have yet to be determined, the BBC reports. UN Chief Ban Ki-moon said the Syrian opposition controlled significant parts of some cities. He said that established terrorist groups could have been behind some of the recent bomb blasts in Syria, judging from the sophistication of the attacks. Regardless of the party responsible for most recent attacks, activists say the ceasefire plan brokered by UN Arab League envoy Kofi Annan has been less than effective in reducing the violence. France 24 has the details and an increasingly militarized opposition violates the ceasefire. Since it began, human rights activists say some 1,500 civilians have been killed. CNN reports the Syrian National Council has called for an emergency meeting with the UN Security Council. To figure out what exactly their mandate is there, what exactly they can do, and how much more they can do to, uh, uh, to protect civilians in Syria from this kind of savagery. According to CBS, more than 9,000 people, mostly civilians, have been killed in Syria since the conflict began in 2011. For Newsy, I'm Candace Aviles. Multiple sources, the real story.